The House of Representatives has decided to allocate zero confidential funds for the Office of the Vice President and the Department of Education in the 2024 National Budget Bill. MJ Mondehar reports. Controversial confidential funds. As such, the Office of the Vice President and the Departments of Education, Information and Communications, Agriculture, and Foreign Affairs are getting zero confidential funds under the 2024 General Appropriations Bill. The House of Representatives has decided to allocate zero confidential funds for the Office of the Vice President and Department of Education in the 2024 National Budget Bill. The $1.23 billion request for confidential funds for the mentioned agencies will reportedly be allocated to agencies involved in defending the West Philippine Sea. It will also be added to the maintenance and other operating expenses of other government offices. We believe that the House of Representatives is on the right side of history. We are responding to the call of the times. And the volatile situation in the West Philippine Sea calls for the immediate and decisive action to protect our national sovereignty. The House is confident that the Senate will follow its version of using confidential funds, even if the budget versions of both chambers go through bicameral deliberations. Meanwhile, the House of Representatives has denied having 1.6 billion pesos in confidential funds this year. This comes as the issue has gone viral on social media. According to Congresswoman Kimbo, these are extraordinary funds and not confidential funds. This is despite the item being listed under confidential intelligence and extraordinary expenses of the House of Representatives. Ang heading ay confidential intelligence and extraordinary. So magkaiba po yung confidential doon po sa extraordinary. Yung extraordinary po ay fully auditable. For instance, extraordinary expenses may include funds for calamities. According to foreign relations analyst Sasro Gando Sasot, the regulation on extraordinary expenses is more lenient. She stated that it is based on information from a retired co-official whom she did not name. According sa isang retired na taga-COA na kumontak sa akin, mas malala ang extraordinary expenses. Kasi ang extraordinary expenses, certification lang ang kailangan. Less strict ito kaysa sa confidential funds na, mar na mas strict ang mga requirements. Okay? So, extraordinary expenses, certification lang. As House of Representatives, ang may control niyan ay ang House Speaker. 1.6 billion. For Gunnamabalab Philippines, I'm Jamon Dihar, SMNI News.